cost of IVF. Once you have been suggested to undergo IVF, one thing which pops up in the mind is, oh my god, IVF is so expensive, can I really afford it? Well, I am Dr. Sneha, fertility consultant and gynecologist. In this video, I will be explaining about the cost of IVF. So IVF normally involves injections which are given to grow the eggs and then we retrieve the eggs, take the eggs out of the ovary and in the lab we inject sperm into the eggs or allow them to undergo IVF, grow the embryos and then transfer it back into the uterus. So there are certain costs which are very visible like the cost of injections or the cost of you undergoing scans or blood tests. These come into one category and the costs which are come into the invisible category are the costs that you may not be aware of. One is the lab, the equipments which go into making a lab and the media which are used in the lab to grow the embryos. All these are equally important, in fact more important in deciding your success rate. So one is the cost of injections, how much is it going to cost? It totally depends on the dose of injections used, the brand of injections used, the duration in for which you require stimulation. There is a variation between person to person and the cost of injections may vary somewhere between 70,000 to 1 lakh rupees. Next is the IVF process per se. You know, it includes different processes in different IVF centers. Some centers may include the scans and the consultations and everything. And also some of them may start with the process of egg retrieval and uh, the growing of embryos in the lab. This will cost, uh, it depends and they may have different packages. Somewhere between 80,000 to 1 lakh 30,000 rupees is what we are looking at. Next, if we ha have a fresh transfer, then it will be one cost. Or sometimes we may freeze the embryos because the uh, lining of the uterus may not be proper or there may be certain hormonal disturbances or when we get more eggs we may not be able to transfer it in the same cycle due to the risk of ovarian hyperstimulation syndrome. In these conditions we freeze the embryos and then take it out in the subsequent cycle and prepare them for embryo transfer. So this comes as frozen embryo transfer and this cost of also may vary between centers depending uh, from about uh, 30,000 per cycle to about 50,000 per cycle. So this is the approximate values which you can expect before undergoing an IVF. Also remember to ask for how many months you're going to freeze the embryos. Keep that in mind because different centers have different uh, protocols as to how long they're going to freeze the embryos and what is the cost of it. So before deciding the place of undergoing IVF, it's not only the cost which is important, it's also the experience of your clinician who is going to do your IVF and also experience of the embryologist and the equipments which are there in the embryology lab which is going to decide your success rate.